In this video, I will be explaining the BCA third semester subject Applied Mathematics as prescribed by Usmania University and other universities of Telangana. We will go through the important questions and answers one by one. Let's begin with a quick revision. Unit 4 first important short question is Define Rank Theorem Definition The Rank Theorem says for any matrix A of size M times N, rank A plus nullity A is equal to N, where rank A is equal to number of linearly independent columns of A or rows. Nullity A is equal to dimension of the null space of A, number of free variables in AX is equal to zero. Explanation in simple words. Think of columns of a matrix as directions in space. Some columns might be combinations of others they are dependent. The independent columns form the rank. Any remaining extra freedom in solutions of AX is equal to zero is the nullity. Rank plus nullity always equals total number of columns. Example Let A is equal to Columns only first column is independent rank is equal to 1. Number of columns is equal to 3 nullity is equal to 3 to 1 is equal to 2. Check rank plus nullity is equal to 1 plus 2 equals 3 works. Memory tip. Independent columns count is equal to rank, leftover freedom is equal to nullity, add them is equal to total columns. This makes rank theorem easy to remember and apply. Next important short question is to Define limit point. Limit point, accumulation point. Definition A point x underscore zero is called a limit point of a set if every neighborhood of x zero contains at least one point of s different from x zero. In simpler words, no matter how tiny a circle or interval you draw around X0, you will always find some points of the set S inside it other than X0 itself. Explanation in simple words. Imagine points scattered on a line. A limit point is a point where the set gets infinitely close, even if the point itself is not in the set. It's like a magnet attracting points of the set nearby. Example. Let S is equal to 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4. The point 0 is not in S, but points of S get arbitrarily close to 0. So, 0 is a limit point of S. Also, all points 1, 1, 2, 1, 3 are not limit points because you can find a small interval around them that contains no other points of S. Memory tip. A limit point is equal to a point that the set can never escape near it, even if the point itself isn't in the set. Next important short question is to Find the characteristic polynomial of A is equal to Problem Find the characteristic polynomial of A is equal to Step 1. Recall the formula. The characteristic polynomial of a square matrix is Debt A lambda I is equal to zero, where I is the identity matrix and lambda is a variable. Step 2. Write A lambda I. Step 3. Find the determinant. Step 4. Final characteristic polynomial. Memory tip. Subtract lambda from diagonal find determinant simplify that's your polynomial. Next important short question is 4. If A is a 7 times 9 matrix with a two-dimensional null space, what is the rank of A? Problem. Matrix has 7 times 9 and the null space of A has dimension 2. Find the rank of A. Step 1. Recall the rank nullity theorem. Rank nullity theorem. Rank A plus nullity A is equal to number of columns of A. Here. Number of columns n is equal to 9. Nullity is equal to dimension of null space is equal to 2. 
Step 2. Substitute values. Rank A plus 2 is equal to 9. Step 3. Solve for rank. Rank A is equal to 9 dash 2 is equal to 7. Step 4. Check. The rank cannot exceed the number of rows 7 times 9 matrix max rank is equal to 7. So our answer is correct. Answer. Rank A is equal to 7. Memory tip. Rank plus nullity is equal to total columns subtract nullity from columns to get rank. Simple as that. Next important short question is 5. Prove that eigenvalues of a triangular matrix are entries on its main diagonal. Problem. Prove eigenvalues of a triangular matrix is equal to its diagonal entries. Let obey an n times an upper triangular matrix. Step 1. Recall characteristic equation. Agent values are found from. Det a lambda i is equal to 0. Here, choose the identity matrix. Step 2. Use property of triangular matrix. Determinant of a triangular matrix is equal to product of diagonal entries. Step 3. Solve for agent values. This gives. Hence, agent values of a triangular matrix are its diagonal entries. Memory tip. Triangular matrix determinant is equal to product of diagonal subtract lambda diagonal entries is equal to agent values. Super easy. Next unit 4. Long questions. First important long question is. Find characteristic equation of A is equal to. Problem. Find the characteristic equation of. A is equal to. Step 1. Recall the formula. The characteristic equation is. Det A lambda I is equal to 0. Where 2 is the identity matrix and is a variable. Step 2. Write A lambda I. A lambda I is equal to. Step 3. Use property of upper triangular matrix. This is an upper triangular matrix. All elements below diagonal are 0. Determinant of triangular matrix is equal to product of diagonal entries. Det A lambda I is equal to. Step 4. Characteristic equation. This is the characteristic equation. Memory tip. Triangular matrix determinant is equal to product of diagonal subtract lambda multiply done. Next important long problem is 2. Find agent values and agent vectors of A is equal to. Problem. Find agent values and agent vectors of. A is equal to. Step 1. Recall the formula. Agent values satisfy. Det A lambda I is equal to 0. Step 2. Write A lambda I. A lambda I is equal to. Step 3. Find determinant. Det A lambda I is equal to. Step 4. Solve 2 times 2 determinants. Step 5. Expand determinant. Simplify. Expand. Multiply by minus 1. This is the characteristic equation. Step 6. Factorize. Try lambda is equal to 2, 3, 6. Use factor theorem. So, agent values. Step 7. Find agent vectors. For each lambda, solve a lambda i, v is equal to 0. Example, for lambda is equal to 2. Similarly, find agent vectors for lambda is equal to 3, 6. Answer. Agent values, 2, 3, 6. Agent vectors, solve a lambda i, v is equal to 0 for each lambda. Memory tip. Agent values debt, a lambda i, is equal to zero factor easy. Agent vectors solve, a lambda i, v is equal to zero get direction vector. Next important long problem is 3. Find a basis for eigen space corresponding to listed eigen values where a is equal to, lambda is equal to 1, 3. Problem. Matrix. 
a is equal to comma age in values lambda is equal to 1 3 we need the basis of age in spaces corresponding to each age in value step 1 recall formula for age in vectors for age in value lambda age in vectors satisfy a lambda i v is equal to 0 here v is equal to step 2 age in vectors for lambda is equal to 1 a 1 i is equal to solve from first row to x is equal to 0 x is equal to 0 second row gives same to x is equal to 0 x is equal to 0 y is free let y is equal to t so age in vectors v is equal to basis for lambda is equal to 1 step 3 age in vectors for lambda is equal to 3 a 3 i is equal to solve second row to x to y is equal to 0 x is equal to y first row 0 is equal to 0 no new info so age in vectors v is equal to basis for lambda is equal to 3 answer agent value basis of agent space lambda is equal to 1 lambda is equal to 3 memory tip agent vectors solve a lambda i v is equal to 0 free variable gives direction basis is simplest vector along that direction next important problem is 4 find the basis of row space column space and null space of a is equal to problem matrix a is equal to we need basis of row space column space null space step 1 row reduce the matrix rref to find row space and null space easily reduce auto row echelon form after performing row operations just showing simplified results for clarity rref a is equal to there are three non-zero rows so rank is equal to three number of free variables is equal to n rank is equal to 5 dash 3 is equal to 2 step 2 basis for row space row space is spanned by non-zero rows of rref basis of row space is equal to remember row space comes from non-zero rows of rref step 3 basis for column space column space corresponds to columns of original matrix that contain leading ones in rref leading ones are in columns 1 2 5 of rref pick columns 1 2 5 of original matrix basis of column space is equal to remember column space corresponding columns in original matrix Step 4. Basis for Null Space Null space is found from solution of Ax is equal to 0. From RREF. Let free variables. Then solution vector. X is equal to. So basis of null space. Step 5. Summary. Space basis. Row space. Column space. Null space. Memory tip. Row space non-zero rows of RREF. Column space original matrix columns with leading ones. Null space free variables form vectors. This is the fastest way to remember without confusion. Next important long problem is. 5. Find the characteristic polynomial and real eigenvalues of matrix A is equal to. Problem. Matrix. A is equal to. We need characteristic polynomial and real agent values. Step 1. Characteristic polynomial. The characteristic polynomial of a matrix as given by. Det A lambda I is equal to 0. Here I is the identity matrix and is the agent value. A lambda I is equal to. Now calculate the determinant. Det A lambda I is equal to. Step 2. Simplify the equation. Take square root. 2 lambda is equal to plus or minus 7. 
Solve for lambda. Step 3. Answer. Characteristic polynomial. Real agent values. Memory tip. For 2 times 2 matrix. Characteristic polynomial. Then solve quadratic to get agent values. This is fast, easy and exam friendly.